A new 10-part docuseries goes behind the scenes at the FBI. In the Paramount Plus original, FBI True, agents pull back the curtain and reveal how they solved some of the most infamous cases in American history. Here's a preview. It was about 8.30 at night, and one of my agents calls me, and he's like, a bomb just went off in New York. A device had been placed outside of a demolition dumpster and had launched this demolition dumpster about 125 feet, all the way across 23rd Street. Come, come, come with me. A number of people were hurt. Come with me. I'm holding you. Okay. I was at the scene on 23rd Street, and my sergeant called, and he said, hey, we have a suspicious package up on 27th Street. And I said, a bomb just went off in Manhattan. Everything is going to be a suspicious package. Joining us in Studio 57 is the creator of FBI True, Craig Turk. He's also a co-creator for several television series, including FBI. Craig, welcome. Mm -hmm. Thanks so much for being here. I mean, as we see there, these are such compelling cases. We remember them well. We remember covering some of these yeah, cases sure. as well. What inspired this new series, and how is it different from other docu-series that are out there? You know, it's funny. What inspired this was a conversation I overheard in a bar. I had, um, I was doing some research with the FBI, so I was here for about six months talking to agents at the Bureau. And I spent a lot of time in their offices, and they kind of came through unit by unit to tell me what they did and how they did it. And I went downstairs uh, to meet someone for a drink one day, and downstairs from the Joint Terrorism Task Force is a bar called the Brass Monkey. And I walked in, and there were two agents who I had met previously who were talking, and I kind of sat down next to them at the bar. And I listened to the conversation that they had between themselves, and it was so much different. It was so kind of emotional and interesting and unguarded. And I thought, oh my gosh, if I can access that and sort of give people an insight into that kind of privileged conversation, um, I would love to do it. And that, I, once, I, once I heard that, I thought, it's, it's just something that we had to do. That's what's so fascinating, too, beyond the cases investigators cover and the issues they're delving into. There's real interpersonal challenges that come with this type of job. I've always been struck uh, by FBI agents I've met as well, that kind of personal weight they carry. You worked with um, Anne Began on this. She's an exactly. FBI agent involved in this program as well. Talk to us about how you leaned on her experiences, her personal views, to help flesh this out. She's been a fantastic partner, as you said, you know, 20 years in the FBI, a really storied career, and I think was just an incredible gateway to these agents. She's someone who knew so many people in the Bureau and was so trusted and was able to sort of, you know, put us in touch. You know, I did this in conjunction with See It Now Studios um, and Susan Zerinsky, who's a longtime CBS News mm -hmm. um, leader, and we really wanted to get inside the heads of these agents and have them feel like they could tell these stories in their own words so we could get that kind of exactly what you're talking about. The sense of what does it feel like? What yeah. are you scared of? What is meaningful to you? Um, and Anne really helped us unlock that with these agents. I'm really interested to hear these stories because we remember covering some of these stories, these high profile cases the show covers like the Boston Marathon bombing, Waco, even the DC sniper. I was right. in Washington. I remember that well. How do you go about retelling these major headlines? Because at the time, I mean, they were so absolutely compelling and gripping as they were unfolding. It seems like there were so many layers to so many of these stories. Absolutely. You know, there, there are two things that we, we always try to do. One is parts of these stories that never got told. Right. So the first episode that, that, that we just released on Paramount Plus is about the Chelsea bombing. It's 2017, five or six years ago. So many parts of that story never came to light. And so the ability to tell the behind the scenes of this is what was really going on. This is what the Bureau was worried about. This is what the Bureau couldn't find. This is what the Bureau thought might happen. Has been really tremendous. And I think that's one of the things that we love about this show. And the other is getting into the heads of these agents, feeling that pressure really firsthand. Because as we know, that situation, a lot of the stories we tell did resolve well. Not all of them, but they did resolve well, or they had sort of partially wonderful you know, resolutions, but you know, lives were lost. Feeling what it was like to be an agent on the ground during these um, these cases is, I think, the most compelling part of the series. And we know we're going to hear a lot of stories in this series. Um, you use footage, you've got graphics, maps, these experiences from investigators who I'm sure for these cases stay with them no matter the conclusion, but especially if it's anything that's unsolved. What else might we expect to see in this series? Absolutely. You know, one of the episodes in particular is... Um, 
called the, it's about the Hannah Anderson kidnapping. Mm. Um, and that, I think, is one of the episodes that was most striking to us because you really do get a sense for what was, what was this like on the ground and how dramatic was this and how much has it stuck with the agents who were involved. And I think in the same way that, you know, these are the stories that they came on and said, here's the case I really want to talk to you guys about. It really sticks in my head, and I think will stick in, in viewers' head for that same reason. So um, that one's dropped in, and um, I think is, is really interesting. And going forward, we'll have, as you said, you know, the, the um, marathon bombing um, and uh, some other episodes that we're really, really excited about. Well, it looks fascinating, and I think it really it's does. important for people to see the multifaceted aspects of what it takes, right, to actually bring an investigation to conclusion. Craig Turk, Craig, thank you so much for joining us. I really yeah. appreciate Thanks it. Thanks for being here, Craig. Thanks for having me. And all episodes of FBI True are available now on Paramount+. Plus.